What has Jesus called us to? Well, listen to the words of Jesus. If any of you wants to be my follower, you must give up your own way. Take up your cross daily and follow me. If you try to hang on to your life, you'll lose it. But if you give up your life for my sake, you'll save it. In Matthew chapter 5, Jesus says this, You are the salt of the earth. But what good is salt if it's lost its flavor? Can you make it salty again? Will it be thrown out and trampled underfoot as worthless? Jesus said, you are the light of the world, like a city on a hilltop that cannot be hidden. And no one lights a lamp and then puts it under a basket. Instead, a lamp is placed on a stand where it gives light to everyone in the house. In the same way, let your good deeds shine out for all to see so that everyone will praise your heavenly Father. You see, and then in Matthew chapter 28, Jesus said these very powerful words. I have been given all authority in heaven and on earth. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Teach these new disciples to obey all the commands I have given you. And be sure of this, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. The point, what has Jesus called us to? To be a disciple of Jesus who disciples for Jesus. My encouragement to you today, live for what matters. Live for Jesus and help others do the same.